Hand capper Steve here, hand capping the racing from Zia Park here on Tuesday, September the 23rd, 2014. I am going to be hand capped two races for you, races one and race ten. So let's get on to today's first race, feature quarter horse race on the program. It is an 870 yard allowance race, purse $28,000. It is for three of our horse number one, three races. We do have a field of eight horses traveling the distance. Oh, 870 yards. Very nice race indeed. Going 870 yards. And I'm going to go with the six horse here. Number six. Elisa G. Uh, Alfonso Perez is in the saddle. Last time out. Or Zia Park. Uh, 870 yards on the mud. September 8th and claim race for 5,000. Finished, uh, won that day by half line. Ten favorites do right up in the final strides. Um, that was this horse's uh, fourth time running against the quarter horses in the, uh, these mixed breeds races. I have to say, this horse really, really does well in these races. Then we're doing so five furlongs on August the 22nd. On a claim race, 5,000. Came third by uh, four and three quarter lengths. He dueled with the weekend. The thing is, this horse has a bunch of speed. They tried running this horse in a... Uh, in a mile races last season, the uh, run of mile on uh, September 16th last year on a good go. Finished fourth by 33 lengths. He was well off the rail, just gave away, but was unbelievable uh, for all that race. But to these 870 uh, races, this horse has a lot of speed, so this horse does well in them. First career one was at uh, 870 on Redosa on the mud. August 11th, one by a neck that day. He battled and stretched and prevailed. This horse also likes a wet track. 32 added. Um, last I saw today, it was a muddy track at Redoso. Actually, the last couple uh, days I've been watching, uh, excuse me, Zia, um, the track has been wet. So watch out uh, if the track is wet. Watch out for this one. Let's go on with this one here. Um, so, cat my best for some more. I'm Zia Park. Going with the six. Now, uh, let's head on down to race number 10. The tenth race from Zia. What is a claiming race actually? It's a claiming race, purse fourteen thousand dollars. It is for three year olds and upwards number one race on main claim starter since uh, March of two thousand and fourteen, which are one four races. But one mile here, we do have a field of seven going close to one mile. And I will be going with the seven horse here. Number seven, Slam It. Three to one, Y Alcaberry. Last time out, doing it. Uh, Canterbury Park, seven and a half pounds, July 26th. And claim race for 10,000. Uh, finished eight by two and a half lengths. I have to say, this horse does not like turf. I uh, hit a clear stop and just really not, never got into it. This horse has run three times on the turf, has never did well on it. But a Canterbury, six and a half pounds, June the 30th, uh, June the 13th, claim race 16,000. Finished third by like that day. He battled him on the inside, just not his best run. But I want to, uh, starts to like him this course. I want to go back to his last season, November 25th, my birthday, 2013 at Z01 now an optional claimer. But just after my half life, he's unable to uh, fend off the foe that day. But then Z01 won my claim race last season, October 29th, one mile. One by two and a half lengths, he was clear and kept to the task. Uh, there weren't an optional claim race, that was against a lot tougher horses. Um, but I really do like this horse here a lot. It's three to one. Workout to Zia Park five round workout one of one in three. Seventh best on twenty nine that day. So going with this one. So we kept my bets first number ten from Zia Park. I am gonna go with seven. Good luck to all.